All right, there, guys. Welcome back to Feed the Beast. Today, what we're going to be doing is building a industrial blast furnace from Greg's Tech. Hooray! This is going to be not that much fun. All right, but before we start talking about that stuff, let's um put our jetpack on. Yeah. Um, someone like asked me to make a this thing, a uh, advanced electric jetpack, which can hold. Is that a million? Yeah, a million EU, and it's also like. It's a lap pack as yeah, but I can't make the lap pack yet. I, I, I can probably make that. Wait, we just need the Labratron. Yeah, but that's a lot of stuff. I won't really focus on that just yet, but that's definitely something I'll think about getting uh, in the soon to sort of close future. Yeah, anyway, I found a cave over here. Well, I kind of found one, but there's a cave over here, and I jumped in it looking for some copper. Uh, I found a little bit more. I just need more because, oh, hey. There's some emerald. Oh, look, there's some right there. Wow, I totally passed that stuff. Look, there's emerald right here. Why would I? Why would I go past emerald? I mean, like, even though I I do have automatic mining, it's still like good going down into caves and uh and finding stuff by itself. But anyway, uh, or like you know by yourself, yeah. But I around here I found a zombie spawner. Hooray! And let's see what's in the chest. Oh, okay, we got a page. A saddle and some oh some tin. Oh, I'll just leave with this stuff here, but what we can do is we can get our um zombie shoal shard uh, shoal shard soul shard and right click on that and then we go up a tier. Nice. Oh <laughs> and we'll keep it like that because now we got floaty torches. That's sick. Um oh look at this, look at this. Look at this, man. Look at all this stuff around here. I'll take all that because we need quite a lot of uh copper today. Um ooh. Hey there. Hey there. That thing. No, okay. Ooh. See, I didn't know this cave was here. It's pretty useful having all this uh copper. Because cop the thing with copper is it spawns really high, so when you like if you go like branch mining, it's hard to find it. Like really hard to find it. Um anything else down here? Alright, I'm not gonna go too far down into this cave. Because we're not here for the cave in, aren't we? And we still got this yeah, vile saw with Bane of Arthropods. I'm just going to use it because it looks badass. Look at this. Bam, pow. We actually do look like a Power Ranger with um with this this on. We've got like this crazy sword. <laughs> someone said something like, someone said something like uh, uh, what was it? Like, strawberry? I don't know. Something to do with Power Rangers and me being a strawberry jam. Okay, let's come over here. Turn on hover mode. Oh, yeah, it's gonna take forever. Come back over here and um, come on. I wish this went like forward faster because uh, it's kind of annoying. Alright. Whoop! So, hey, come over here. Take you off because you're gonna just annoy me, aren't you? <laughs> Alright, come over here. Let's see. Ah, most right. Okay, that's cool. I'm just getting some more of uh, some more of these because we need them. Uh, I should actually start compressing those. Uh, whoop. Alright, let's put you guys in, and then we'll go like this. Oh, it's like this, isn't it? Yeah. Wham. Nice. Put you in there. Okay, so the industrial blast furnace is to make silic silicone... Oh, and yeah, lag in classic. Silla... Oh, where is it? Uh, wait, if we type in the solar... Oh, God, that any yeah, lag. <laughs> we, we need them to make... Oh, yeah, here. Silicon plates... And to make a silicon plate, you put two silicon cells into a blast furnace, and silicon cells are made with a liquid transporter. Wait. Did we? Oh, yeah, we need the. Wait. Hold up. Am I doing this right? Silicon cell. Oh, but to make the silicon cell, we make a liquid transporter. Wait, what the. F Alright, why didn't I think about this before I decided to make the blast furnace? Oh, I'm such an idiot! Ah! Why are you lagging, Nanny Eye? Alright, change of plan. Slight change of plan. Um, so to make these silicon plates... Alright, no, the silicon, silicon cells. Damn it, I'm so dumb. Why didn't I think about ever making those? So, the way I've decided to do it is by using the electrolyzer, because we need the electrolyzer to make to get the titanium. So... To do that, we put uh, the sand in here, we give it 20,000, 5,000 EUs, and it goes through here, bam, and it gives us some silicon. So the first thing we need to make is the electrolyzer. Oh, I guess we can make the blast furnace first, but like, let's just make the electrolyzer for fun. Oh god. 
Okay, so... Uh, Alright, this stuff's all pretty easy. We just need some... Hey, get back here. We need some... First of all, we need... Uh, duh, duh. I'll make about four... Oh, man, this... Without the 1.5 spread clicking here, that's so, like, difficult. So we need four of those. Let's make a project table, actually, because this is kind of a little little bit of a project, and it'll be easy to keep all our stuff in there, wouldn't it? Ugh, I can't believe I didn't think about that. I want to make some uh, some solar panels today, or at least, like, get stuck. Wait, what do I... Ah, oh, project. Project table. Here. Oh, project. Stone, wood, a craft bench, and a thing. Okay, like that. Wham, and like you. And we need three stone. I really got to organize these chests sometimes. I think I think I'm gonna say that for the rest of the series. Just say, uh, I think I need to organize these chests soon because I'm never gonna do it. <laughs> I don't know if we make a sorting system, I guess they can organize themselves. Tee hee. All right, got you. Um, if you don't know what a project table is, it's basically a crafting table with like a chest inside of it, and um. Yeah, that's... <laughs> I explained it in my last season, so if you guys want to go watch that, it's like the second episode or third episode, and I explained them, I guess. But, like, we got this guy here. We can just... Actually, I don't like it there. Let's move it, like, over here somewhere. Here. So, let's put these guys in here. And we can type in electrolyzer. Um, okay, so we need four refined iron for the outside. Actually, we'll put all that in there because we're going to need a lot of it. Uh... And then we need advanced circuits. Oh, shoot. How, how expensive are these? We need... I know, we need an assembly table to make those. So we'll just go with the circuits. So we need two normal circuits. And then we just go back and we make them advanced using lapis. And, okay, sweet. So two normal... Okay, we already got one in here. Actually, we're going to need a lot of them. How many do we need? So we need three... I think we need five, actually. Three, four. F oh, no, we don't need one for that. So th we need four more. Uh, if I can... Here we go. And we've got some copper and rubber in here. I think so. Yeah. In our inventory. Okay, so that should be enough. Whoop. And now we make... Oh, that might not be enough. We need four, don't we? Uh, redstone. Yoink. Oh, we're running super low. Actually, I think I have some in my bags. <laughs> Don't worry, Mitchell. Don't worry. Ah, uh, oh, damn it! Did I really put all the? Are you serious? I put all the iron. Oh well, we can, we can just come down here and do it. Not a big deal. We need the refined iron to uh to make these. So this is the first time I've ever. Ow! This is the first. <laughs> I just had my microphone stand while I went to itch my nose. I was just like, I'm gonna scrape my nose. Ow! Okay. We can just do this, can't we? And it'll pull from the table. And then one like that. So one, two, three, four. Okay, sweet. We got one in there. All right, dirt. Wow. <laughs> All right, so there's those. Got the four of those. And we need two of those for machines and two of them for circuits. Now, for the machines, we need one extractor. Uh, that's pretty easy. We just need some tree taps. One, two... Oh, God, why do that? Why? I forgot the shift clicking work like that. It used to be different in the old version. Oh, well, now we have some extra tree... <laughs> now we have some extra tree taps. All right, we put these guys in here. We might need another extractor or something. I don't know. I, I have no idea. Okay, put you up there, and I'll give us one extractor, and we don't need any more of you. Uh, and now we need the electrolyzer. So we need a couple of empty cells. That's what we need the tin for. And then we need some more copper cable. Ooh! Wait, do we have anything in in our bags? Ooh, there's a there's a stack of tin in there. What, what, why is all that useful stuff in there? In here? Am I blind? Yeah, I am. Okay. Ooh, we need some more... Um... Rubber. Rubber! Where is it? Do we have any in here? We have rubber wood. I think we can extract from that, can't we? Smell. 
Okay, smelt rubber wood into charcoal. Wait, can we extract from it? Industrial sawmill. Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah, we'll extract from the from the rubber wood. That will give us a little bit of rubber. So I'll quickly do that and I'll jump back after a quick load of extracting. So, rah! Not compressing, extracting. Ah, oh, no. Here we go. <laughs> Alright, see you guys in a little bit. Alright, so I got the rubber and we got some more of you. Yoink. Oh, come on. And now we need, what was it? It was like this, wasn't it? Wham. 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 And then like that. Nice. Okay, so we got the electrolyzer down. Now we need just one more, and that is the magnetizer, which I don't even know what this thing does. Like, I think you just use it in recipes. That's like all you do with it. So we need some iron fencing. This stuff is pretty sick for building if you guys want to use it. Wait, does it have the cool texture in this? Oh, no. Wait, what texture pack does it have the cool texture in? I swear it was the Sfax one. I think that might be something else. Creeper face fence or something. I don't know. I remember it used to, I think. I don't know. Oh, well. Let's turn you into that. We'll put you in there, and we'll make you like this. Sweet. And now we just need a little bit of glowstone, redstone, and lapis, and we can make this machine. I think I'm going to be able to make some titanium, but I probably won't have enough time to uh, make some tools. So, episode after this, we'll make some sweet... How, like, tier, th tier three? Nice. I'm just looking at my soul shard. Uh, yeah, so episode after this, we can start using some titanium to... Uh, to build some stuff with because uh, titanium is part of Greg's tech I'm pretty sure and um, it basically makes the all the tools and then once we get uh, like an advanced diamond drill we can make an epic massive quarry and start just shoving all this stuff in that's after we get our solar panels though so we need the solar panels first and that's why we're doing all this stuff now that makes sense all right so two of you in there it's two to this two of this and then four of this. There we go. Two circuits. And if I can remember the recipe, it's like this. And then... What was that? Yeah, like this. Nope. Yeah, there we go. Industrial electrolyzer. Awesome. Um, now, this needs... Max input is 128. So, this outputs 128. So, we could just... Um, I think I'm going to make some glass fiber cable. Actually, what's this? I don't think this stuff, like, retains for very long. I just made it so we could, uh, reach it through there. We could actually put copper cable there, but we had loads of this. Anyway, I think I'm going to make some glass fiber. Glass fiber cable. Where is it? Come on. Where are you? Here. Glass fiber cable. And that is a diamond. Okay, we need some silver for those. They, they're pretty easy to make. Use, I really suggest if you ever make these, don't use redstone, use silver because um, cause it gives you two more. It's worth it's worth, worth the diamond. Okay. Ooh, okay. I was like, where are my diamonds? Far. Okay, you, and then we need some glass. There we go. And we're just going to make five lots of them. Bam. Oop. Oh, bam. Nice. We can put you back. We can put that tin back. And we can put you back here. Uh, actually, no. You don't go in there. You go here. Uh, here. Glass fiber cable is awesome because it, like, it goes for ages. Uh, I think it's, like, it takes, like, 40 blocks for it to start losing, um, stuffs. What's it called? Uh, ticks or EU or whatever it's called. And, um, it also, um, what else? What it does also? What? Wait, it, <laughs> it, yeah, it can take a lot of, um, energy. Okay, so, I think that's good enough. Yeah, like this. We can wire these up like this. There we go. There we go, and this should be getting power. How do I know if it's getting power? Uh, I guess we'll find out in a sec. Um, first thing I want to do though is to put a little bit of um, peat into these guys. Because we have loads of it. And uh, oh, we might need a bit more than that. Just to get enough uh, energy coming through to power the electrolyzer while it's, uh, while it's, you know, making its, doing its thing. 
Alright, I've, I've only messed around with this thing a little bit, so if I make a mistake, my bad. So don't copy me. Uh, by the way, guys, I think uh, two episodes on... Once we get our quarry set up, so maybe two or three episodes in a couple of weeks, we'll start um, Thorncraft, because I know a lot of you guys are excited about that, and we'll just uh, move away from the uh, industrial craft and the uh, all the modern stuff, and we'll start to uh, do some wizardy cool things. And I, I want to make a brain in, the, in a jar, and I want to make like an XP grinder using soul shards. Um, to enchant stuff. Anyway, so, the way this thing works, uh, if we type in, what do we want? Silicone. Here, these things here. Silicon cell. Now, what we need is we need, okay, so, oop, I just, wow. Well, okay, so it's going to take 25,000 EU, um, at 50 seconds. It'll take 50 seconds to complete the process. And the max energy it needs is 25 EU per tick. And it also needs 16 sand and 2 empty cells. So, we have 2 empty cells over here. I don't know why I'm doing this. I should put like... Nah, this doesn't need that much power. And then we need sand. I think we have loads of sand. <laughs> Look at these. Oh my god! Let me through! Let me through! Yeah, I need to start up these engines again. I might change them. I might change them to like um, electric engines or something. Um, I don't know because... These ones keep running out. Uh, if I like say FK with the Pete. And we're moving on to more difficult times. Okay, so this should start working now. Uh, it's got power going to it and everything. So. Is power coming out of here? Uh, but. Oh, yeah, that thing's turned on. Uh. Are we doing this right? 25 EU. Hmm. Uh. Hello? Do you need to be powered from the side? Hmm. Come on, it worked last time. Wait, let me just, uh, turn you off. Hmm. Um, I'm going to play around with this in a creative world. I'll see how it works and I'll jump right back when I'm ready. So, okay, okay, I know you guys were probably face palming the entire time. <laughs> the MFV only has one output, Dep. <laughs> Alright, get out of here. Oh, there's some, uh, what don't I, oh god. We have a backpack, let's just put it in that. Put some stuff in here. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, we need that. Uh, like that. Okay, sweet. Let's get out of here. Oh, we have a jetpack. Wow, I'm not gonna. I'm never gonna get used to that jetpack, I know. Um, here, Birchwood. Yeah. So the MFE only has one output. And I was trying to work out. I was like, why is it working? I've got it all connected. Why is it working? But it only has one output, and I don't want to get it anywhere close to these things, um, because uh, it'll blow, blow a hoe in the. Uh... Actually, what I could do is I could just. Um. Oh god, I'm so scared. This thing. Uh. All right, and now are they getting powered? Okay, cool. And now I can just do this. Don't get. Please don't touch these machines by accident. And get rid of you up here. And connect you to here, and it should start going in straight away. There we go, it lit up, and it's doing work. So this would take, how long did it take this, so let's take, this take 50 seconds to do. And while I do that, I think I'll get some, what did I need for titanium? It doesn't come up with the small pile here. Um, what is the recipe for that? Uh, we need, okay, we need 12 bauxite. And eight empty cells. So that's pretty simple. That's pretty simple, isn't it? And this is still getting powered. Nice. And you're losing. Ooh, you're uh, you're going over the limit. Ooh, it's about to be. Ah, uh, da 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 da. Come on. Uh, come on. Bam. 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 Where is it? 
There we go. And that gives us one compressed air cell and one silicon cell. And we need two silicon cells to make uh, one solar panel. So it's a lot longer process than, you know, just vanilla industrial craft. Oh, it sounds weird saying that. Vanilla industrial craft. Okay. So we've got tin in here. What are you? You're silver. Okay. Got tin in here. Um, I'm just going to use you to make some more cells. We just need empty cells. I think what the, uh, I don't know. I'm not going to explain it. Um, but we also need some bauxite. How many was it? Eight or 12? 12. Um, let's go that. There we go. And, ooh, we actually need more than that. So I'm going to make some more cells because to make one titanium, we need, uh, four small piles of, um, what's it called? The, uh, uh, I'm not going to make all the titanium now because if you look here, uh, wow, that was a lot. If you look here to make titanium dust, it takes 256,000 EU. So, oh, that gives us a lot of compressed air though. That's pretty cool. And aluminum, aluminum. Um, I'm not, yeah, I'm probably just going to make one just for the sake of the video and I'm not going to do them all, uh, all right now. I'll wait till we get our solar panels going so we have a little bit more. Although we do have a lot of just, you know, energy laying around, so I guess we could do it. Okay, so you go in here. Oh, and you go in here and bam, that should suck it in and start going. And you're still full. That's going to take 250,000 E's out of my, uh, my MFE over here. I'm going to grab some more bauxite because this stuff, I think it spawns everywhere now. I think in the old, like, Minecraft pack, it only spawned in, like, certain locations, and that made it, like, really annoying. I think now they spawn in, like, plains and forests. And um, with all these, like, extra biomes, it was really hard to find it, and it was quite annoying. But here we go. We've got that going. And um, I wonder if we have enough time to make the blast furnace. I don't know. I think I've only been recording for, like, 20 minutes, so we have, like, probably another 10 minutes or so. Uh, blast furnace. Right. Yeah, I think I just want to make, like, I just want to make these things, the, the cuprical things. Uh, we need nickel and copper. Do we have any nickel? Nickel's in our, in our chest down here, isn't it? I'm pretty sure it is. Hello, nickel? Potatoes. Nickel, are you there? Um, here we go. And we put that in the rolling machine, and we just let it do its thing. It's annoying that we need four of them. That means we need to do it twice. Okay, so... Um, oh, we need to get you out of my bag. Alright, so, one, two, three, four. Oh, we can actually put this in twice, can't we? Yeah. And the nickel. Alright, sweet, that gives us three of those. Click to craft. Oh, we need power. Um, oh, we got something there. And we click it to craft it. Nice! And how are you going over here? Oh, we're nearly done, and that's gonna give us our first little tiny, 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 tiny power. Okay, we still we could do it once. We could get one piece of titan. Ah, nice. I'm gonna do it again just for the sake of the video, because it's it's worth it. Then we have two pieces of titanium dust. That's epic. Oh, my first titanium dust. Ooh. Oh. What are the use of you? Oh no, did the game crash. Okay, sweet. And then what do we use? Do we can we? It's. We just smelt it down. Okay, we need to put it in. Okay, we need to put it in a blast furnace for 50 seconds to turn that into a titanium ingot. All right. So we need to make the blast furnace to make our tools before. Anyway, so I guess we'll work on that. I, do you guys want me to do the blast furnace off screen? Um, just because um, it's gonna take a while. It's pretty simple. It's rather self-explanatory. You need a lot of copper and like we, basically we need. Two induction furnaces, one uh, advanced machine block, two circuits, and then these things. We've already got these things. This was like the most, I guess, complicated thing. Or kind of. I think the advanced machine block is sort of a little bit complicated. Yeah, because we need to make the uh, mixed metal. But mixed metal is pretty easy with all these other metals that you can make. Um, but yeah, I think that's about it for this video. Uh, why can't I pick you up? All right, we got this full um, bag. Bag time. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Alright, sweet. Uh, I think that's it for this video. There we go. We've got six of them. Uh, we can throw these in our project table ready for um, the next video. We've got to get a machine block ready um, to do to do some uh, some stuff. I'll start I'll start to make some mixed metal ingots just uh, off screen. I'll get all the things ready and I'll make it on, you know, I'll craft it on screen just uh, just to show I'm not cheating because I'm 
I'm legit, too legit to quit. Uh, what do we need? Refined iron, um, bronze and tin. Oh, is there any refined? Here we go. So, one, two, three. I can never remember the order of this. I think it's like this. There we go. And we need, uh, I think it's six, maybe. We'll just do six or however many we can make. Uh, yeah, four, four. That's good enough. Four. So we'll start to make those. They're going. We got the more titanium over here. Um, we're nearly out of power in here. Yeah. So I'll I'll stop with the titanium. But look at this. Bam, bam, bam. First piece of titanium dust. Um, I'll make some more. Oh man, just. Oh, can you can you smell the titanium going through your nose? <laughs> but yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a fantastic day. Be sure to leave some comments down below suggesting. Uh, or if you, if you have any help for me, I guess, because I'm still rather new to this Craig stuff, <laughs> leave a comment down below, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye!